Boys and girls, welcome back to a Fallout video. This one is a viewer request from Zombie Trout. Awesome name. But, yep, they wanted Leatherface. They're getting Leatherface. And I'm rocking a full health build. I forgot to full health myself. I need to put that away. Da, 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 da. And I'm using <clears throat> the Bloody Chef outfit. Which you get from Graham at Meat Week. You can also get a Butcher's Outfit, but I don't have that one. I actually don't have this one. I had to bribe someone to get it for me. Well, I didn't. I bought it from the vendor. But anyway, I was reading up at the law, and um, it's loosely based around a true story. Um, as a mentally disabled member of a family of deranged cannibals. Well, at least we've got the mentally disabled bit going for us. Anyway, uh, this is a build. Uh, again, I haven't used all the spots. I'm just using them for weight, so ignore that, ignore that. So, Slugger, Master Slugger, Expert Slugger. Uh, stable tools, just so they don't break as quick. Which is pointless, because I, I don't need Makeshift Warrior. Um, tenderizer. Because with full health, we're going for the full health build. I, I saw the movies, but never really paid attention to them. But you can also whack the cannibal perk in, which I don't have. Not on this character, anyway. But yeah, uh, bang the cannibal perk in, because he's a cannibal, after all. But was, was, what was that? Was that? Go away. Shoo. But anyway, yes, uh, Zombie Trout, I believe his name was... I believe their name was, her name, his name, him, her, he, shim, shim, her, who was it, tell me, yes, zombie trout, uh, sweet, now I'll do leather face next, right, I'm doing leather face, and I'm using the butcher's outfit, which you can get from Meat Week, from Graham, as a plan, I couldn't find anything as a face, mask, thing, I don't know. Not not that suited anyway, because you know just, they don't let us peel the flesh from the people we kill and put it on us faces. So eh, I don't know. Try. I mean that could work. No, it couldn't. Um, maybe that. Maybe that. I don't know. I don't know. So it's either this one. I'm going to be using. Hop into apparel. We've got the Bloody Chef outfit. Um, call it this Monarch mask. <laughs> yeah, it's leather. Fair enough, we'll run with it. It's leather. And what we're using is a chainsaw. We've got two vampires. Chainsaws. 40% uh, weapon speed on this one. It's got the double. Uh, it's got the dual bar mod and the flamer mod. And the Mothman Skeptic skill paint. I don't know if you needed to know that. We've also got a auto wax because technically it is a chainsaw. It runs on a different motor. I think this one runs on a low motor engine, but whatever. Also vampires. Like I said, we're going to go for the fullest of tanky builds, which um should be good. Oh. Which should benefit us greatly. Need food. Have food. Have food. Thank you. So we're gonna jump in and then. We're gonna start out simple because, you know. Babe usually kills. What have I got equipped? Red grenades. He usually kills people. The chainsaw is so loud, and I don't know why. Pop that down a bit so you're not getting your eardrums blasted. But, yeah, uh, he uses a chainsaw normally. And he runs around and goes, like, you know. Because he's not right, ain't Ed? Like me. Alright, let's go find something to kill. Okay, basing this on nothing in particular, but the chainsaw is notoriously a beast so it has the stagger 
It kills quick. Ow! It does that thing. If only my character wasn't a herbivore and was a cannibal instead. Alright, where's the... Is it here? Yeah, should be my alert queen knocking about somewhere. She'll pop up somewhere. So we're going to go for a my alert queen. So I think with a chainsaw full health build we can take one. We could take a my alert queen, surely. Surely. Hello. Eh, I'm stuck. Help. Hello. Where? And the health melts. Alright. Try this one. No! Ah! Damn! No! Pull her out of the water! Pull her out of the water! Yeah, just just drain. Just drain and AP's gone. AP's back, so is the health. And dead. Chainsaw works. Chainsaw is broken whether you have a build for it or not. It's just one of those good all rounders. And it does it is a two handed, so Slugger is the ones that you want. And it has jacked the damage up to... 40? That'd be, that'd be right. Yep, 40. Damn, they really have nerfed this fucking... <gasps> oh, they really have nerfed it. Oh my god, I didn't think it was that bad. Oh, you dirt. Is it Slugger? It is a two-handed weapon. Ah. Interesting. That is very interesting. Is it Slugger? I could have swore it was. Yeah, back up to 40, so... Pop you out again. But yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's Slugger. I thought it was. I'm not insane! Not yet. Yeah. Oh, they really have nerfed the chainsaw. Oh! Bethesda! What are you doing? Spoil sports, nerfing everything with the hell. Yeah, so still going up though. That's probably because I'm getting the devil loving tits irradiated out of me. But well, yeah, that's because of the radiation. But still, it's not bad. Chainsaw's pretty bloody good. Apparently it's better in power armor. I don't know. We'll have to see. I know it used to be better in power armor. It's not great cracky anymore. And I'm diseased. Of course I am. Why won't I be? I made antibiotics though, so I'm good. Uh, well, that's sad. Yeah. Try this one then, because it's got extra damage. It's got like 10 extra damage per rotationary spin. Jesus! Alright, yeah. That one melts. That one melts too. That's good. Okay, let's go um, find something bigger to hit.
Okay, it's been a hot minute since I came to see Big Chungus. Let's um, go say hello to him, shall we? And then I want to test it with a blooded, because... I, well, not really a blooded, like, I'll just drop my health by halfway and then try it again. Ah. Me face. Come out of the water. Come here. It's got the knockback on it, so it pushes him back. That's nice. Okay, so auto axe is good. What can we do for stamina? Like, there are a lot of good consumables for stamina, obviously, but... What else can we do for stamina mana? Oh, I'm not even in a team! Hang on! Let me make a team. I mean... Doing Lone Wanderer might be better, but... Well, never know. Um, yeah. Ba ba ba. Anything for stamina, mana. Being agility, right? So it'd be best to max out agility. Um. That's the only problem when you get staggered. It, it kind of sucks. Let's let let's. How many points have we got in? Eleven. Alright, so we've got four points. Let's see. Could use that. Don't wanna. Evasive. Ah, uh, pop that on. Why not? Um, I've got everything that will. I'll pop a point of sneaking. Uh, let's see what the durability is looking. Like. That's looking pretty good. That's. No, no, I can't repair it here unless I use a repair kit. Okay, let's go play with something angry. Okay, we're up at Hopewell Cave and we're back with the chainsaw. There's rabbit dogs. Let's see. That's not bad. Shh. That actually gave me a jump scare, I am not going to lie. Can't see. That one didn't because I heard it. <laughs> but the other one did. I actually jumped. You here. Baby, come back. Hello? There you are. Hi, princess! Oh, okay. Got a hit off. Not bad. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Got all my stuff maxed out, my perks and stuff. Interesting. It's interesting. I'm going to actually jump onto a proper server. Because I feel like this isn't being maxed out to its full potential yet. Like, I feel like this could be better. So we're going to jump into a... 
a populated server and jump onto a team with other players. See how that goes. Okay, now we're actually in a proper server with real life people. They're not imaginary, I swear. Alright, let's try this one again. Oh yeah, the look at the stagger on that. Dead. That that's so much. All right, so having people on the team is very beneficial, as I thought. So I'm guessing if you're blooded, you could probably run it solo, and it'll do pretty much the same damage, if not more. But with my mutations buffed and everything, this is good. All right, let's go. Test the auto axe on a few death claws, shall we? Okay. Uh, some of you probably know where I am. <laughs> Abandoned waste dump. There's three death claws in here. We'll go pick a fight with them all. And then I want to go test it on something that actually has a fair amount of armor that everybody always seems to forget about. And that will be a good test. So. Hello, can we? Yeah, I got staggered. I got staggered again. Alright, that's dead. Okay, so the auto axe. Pretty good. I feel like the chainsaw spins faster, so you're getting more damage off quicker. Wait, it. it might be my imagination, but where's death claw number three? I can never find death claw number three. Where's your friend? Don't you have one? Is there not a third death claw in here anymore? I could have swore that there is. Can hear it. Is there Bethesda magic at play? Is it is it spawned underground or something? Is there actual Bethesda magic? Has it actually spawned underground? It probably could have spawned underground. I'll take that. Why not? Alright, well, uh, let's go try against the heavily armoured thing that I wanted to test it against. Okay, and here we are. We have a level 100 Glowing Hermit Crab. So we're going to do half with the uh, chain... No, half with the auto axe and then half with the chain. So ah, I wasn't expecting you to run at me like that quick. But yeah. Extremely heavily armoured. Oh, it's nearly dead already. Damn it. Ah, 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 ah. Stop it. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't even get to test it properly. <laughs> um, is there a mile lurk nearby? Yeah, there is. Alright. Let's go play hide and seek for this mile lurk. Okay, we have a plethora of some. I feel like it does more damage faster. I feel like the chainsaw spins faster. Where is my light queen? Usually kicking about somewhere. The eggs are popping. Pop the kids. Where's your mum? I want a word. I need to sell her some double glazing. Interesting. Is 
Very interesting. Okay, so we're seeing it up against the big creatures. It handles the big creatures. Like in a one-on-one -on -one solo situation, I could have swore I saw a red combat bar pop up then. Ah, oh, she's there. She's already dead. I walked straight past her. I am, I am, I am stupid. Okay, someone's already killed her. All right. So we've seen how it does against the singles, the individuals, the bosses, if you will. Let's see how it does against the multiples. Let's see how it does in a crowd. Okay, we're at Huntersville. I prefer Huntersville to West Tech because you're more likely to get swarmed at Huntersville. Really gives you a good chance to test out your damages and someone's already been and cleared it out. <clears throat> oh, it's a suicide. This will be a good test. Oh, we've got Ricochet on as well, so we're going to be gaining health when they shoot at us. Are you in there? Where's the beeper? Yeah, I'm not getting swarmed as much as I hoped I would. There was a female in that bag. Where? Is he under the ground? He's under the ground. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Bethesda magic at work, ladies and gentlemen. The enemy has spawned underground. Okay. Come on now. Behave yourself. See, I want him to get in close. They don't really get in close to, like, you know, do the damage that I want them to do. But the auto axe is handling very well. So is the chainsaw. What that? Super mutant still under the floor. Alright, let's go try where they might actually get close to us. Welcome to Welch. I just got jumped by Brood Mothers before we could hit the record button. Alright. Hello. Would anybody like to be my friend? Please. Anyone? Step up close, come on. Rocket launch, bitch, pussy. Okay, we're regening because we've got Ricochet on, that's just so funny. Alright. It's just, it, this is hilarious. So if you're curious, what Ricochet does, hang on, <clears throat> let me just pop this down a minute. What Ricochet does is, Go away. When you hold a vampire's weapon and you have ricochet activated, it will rebound, hitting them, and then activating the vampire's effect. And yeah, so you become very hard to kill, and it's hilarious. So this 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 is why we do this. All right. Doing well. Deals with the crowd. This is excellent. And like I said, because we have vampires. We have vampires and ricochet. When Ricochet activates, it has the vampire effect when it hits the enemy. So we end up regening all his health back. So, the, yeah, like you saw, we didn't take as much damage as we normally would. Say if I hadn't have been holding this weapon, or if I'd have been holding a different one, I'd have taken a hell of a lot more damage than I did. Let's see if a Sheep Squatch will spawn for us. You're going to be nice. No, it's just going to be floaters. Ah. Uh, wait, what? 
Oh, you're blood eagles. You can deal with them. But yeah, that's the... Um... That's the... That's the leather face build. <laughs> I like the mask. I've got a gimp mask on. <laughs> yeah, so... I don't know what mask to use, because, like, like I say, they don't let us peel the faces off people. It's just Bethesda being killjoys, as usual. So I'm using this, which is a Cultist Monarch mask. You get it from the Mothman Cultist event that happens at Point Pleasant. Uh, the Equinox, that's the one. You get it from there. Uh, this was a full health build. This is what I'm using. These are the cards. You want to use it, it's just... It's good at crowd control. Because of the ricochet, you're just constantly keeping your health. If you have a vampire's one. If you don't have a vampire's one... I'd suggest kill them quicker than they can kill you. <laughs> That's all I can suggest. But other than that, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. I hope you all learnt something. Please leave a like, please subscribe. And you can thank... Um, Trout Boy for this one. I can't remember his name. I forgot his name again. It was so many clips ago. Who was it? Zombie Trout. You can thank him for this one. He, he, he wanted this one, so... Oh, nice. Nice nice little viewer request. I don't mind doing them. So if you have any other requests you want to see, like, I don't know, any other, like, movie characters, real-life peoples... Alright, uh, yeah, if you have any requests that you want to see, let me know, leave a comment. Thank you all for watching, like, subscribe, all that good jazz, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye!